The Clarius is a good field for aesthetics because it's easy to use. Personally, I'm using it more and more and I'm really excited about it. I'm Dr. Ines Werner. I'm a dermatologist and I've been in the aesthetic medicine field for more than 20 years. I'm doing a lot of aesthetic procedures, uh, fillers, threads, energy-based devices, also body treatments for body contouring. Also, I work a lot with uh, companies to develop products, to move this whole field forward. For ultrasound in aesthetics, there are actually three main indications. One is to visualize the filler or to visualize if the patient is coming with a problem. So some patients don't remember where they've had filler. Sometimes the filler can actually move from one area to another. So that would be one indication. The second indication is to prevent actually intravascular injections because as you know the biggest risk when we are injecting is to go intravascular this can lead to blindness this can lead to skin necrosis this can lead to emboli this is a very very dangerous complication so this can actually be prevented by visualizing the vessels so this is the second indication and the third one is when we actually have a problem with the filler to treat it. So for instance, if we have a filler granuloma, or if a filler is injected not properly, or even if it is injected intravascularly, then we can actually use the ultrasound as a guidance to actually treat this possible or this complication. And we can see where it is, we can see where the filler is located, and we can actually treat it accordingly and precisely where we need to be. I've started uh, using ultrasound in my clinic about a year ago. And actually, I started with the L15, with the ultrasound to check the subcutaneous uh, area because we were doing some studies on energy-based devices to actually see the effect on fat. And from there, actually, I learned about the, the L20, which came out. And also, I liked it so much so about the L20, also for the injections. So I've been actually very excited about what is possible to see also in the subcutaneous space, also muscles, but mainly, you know, the face and the vessels and uh, the anatomy. So yeah, we've been using it uh, already a year and actually it's a learning process. So we're improving every day. What I like about the Clarus technology is that it's easy to use, it's portable, it's wireless and you can use it either with an iPhone or an iPad. But moreover, it's very, very important that the image quality is very, very good. And this is due to the frequency that this ultrasound has. It has a 20 megahertz frequency, which actually gives the possibility to have a very, very good image quality up to four centimeters in depth. I would recommend the Clarius technology to my colleagues and actually I have two in the clinic for now. So yes, I think it's good value. I think doctors can buy multiple, um, multiple devices and I don't think the price is a limiting factor for a clinic, uh, for, mainly for an aesthetic clinic, it's really not a limiting factor. The image quality is good. We can really see what we need to see. I think the new L20 is a very good technology for the aesthetic clinic. Also the head, the transducer is quite small, so we can use it in different areas. It's not big because you know in the face, the structures are smaller, so you need a smaller transducer. So that also is a good fit. It's not too big. Um, and uh, it's wireless, so a lot of clinics have multiple rooms, so we can use it in different rooms. And I think the learning curve is also quite easy. So it takes a while, but really with uh, some good training, you can actually learn it easily and use it.